Hello, my friends, and welcome. It is wonderful to have you here. I am Morjax. We are playing Mordheim City of the Damned, and this is a new campaign of sorts. So I had a vote going to see if you guys wanted a new campaign or continue the old, and pretty overwhelmingly you voted for 50-50 split. So this is a warband, the Blighted, that you guys have seen a little bit in my Fanfight Friday. So they have done some PV PvP. Um, they are rank 1, as you can see in the top left. Uh, and I've given them, they had a blue and yellow look before. I've given them sort of these new red duds here. So we've got our leader, Beeblebrox, and uh, Uriant, Sharpadin, Kokel, Radley, Kanor, Resk, and uh, Baldbert. So I'm going to swap in these two new guys for these guys with the injury. And uh, I'm doing a self-imposed rule for this uh, to make it a little more interesting. I can search for one more mission, uh, but I have to take what I'm given. So I can't uh, skip days just to skip missions. Um, so I think that's going to make it a little harder, and I'm probably going to be losing some. So uh, I'm going to do a couple of things on the menu here, and then we are going to jump to the uh, map selection screen. All right, you guys, looking at the maps here. So uh, to just re reiterate what I mean, I can only send out scouts once. So we have three maps available to us every day, and we can only search for one more after that. I'm thinking even either Scavengers Normal with Average Wordstone or Brutal with Exceptional Wordstone. Um, the cash, I'm not really too keen on. It's strike teams and wagon versus strike teams and building. Um, I think I'm gonna go with this brutal, so we'll see. I might get spanked, but we're gonna we're gonna try for it. Oh, sneak attack! Oh, good. Oh, good. A brutal sneak attack. This should be fun. We can now. Oh, oh my gosh! Look at this. I was gonna say we can now deploy, but there's wordstone everywhere. It's all right in front of us. That never happens. Oh my god, did they do they deploy right there? Crap in a hat. They're super close. Ooh, we might even be able to get the alternate wind condition. Holy crap, what is going on with this map? All right, um, Beeblebrox right there. Radley is going to be collecting Wordstone. Ooh, crap. Okay, they're right there. That's their leader. Um, let's see. I think I want to send my archers to get Wordstone first. Uriant is going to be back here. Resk. Oh, you guys, this is really interesting. I don't know what the heck. Ooh, crap. They are all around there. Are we the exploring ones? Oh, jeez. They're up north of us, too? One, two, three, four, five, six. Seems like cheating. All right, let's see if we can glance over here. Yeah, there's a dude right there. Is there more wordstone over there? No, there's not. Okay, let's get this show on the road. Weapons of Destruction is going to be cast on... Uh, what's that guy's name? I didn't, I didn't see it. He's one of my new hires. Resk. And Baldbert. Um, ooh, 34% chance to curse. You know, we're going we're gonna to hold off on that. Oh my gosh. Look at this thing of beauty. Gather that. I can't believe this. This is a, a really bad deployment, but a really, really good... This is probably the best this deployment could have gone uh, in terms of being parked right on top of the Wordstone. And then I think what I want to do, if I can, is hustle over to their cart and try to uh, maybe steal their idol. They have a lot of guys over there. I don't know. I'm kind of surrounded, and I don't totally like that. Do I want to ambush? Let me see. He's all full. I don't really want to cast weapons of destruction. This dude's going to go next. And he's got... I can see he's got pistols, so I'm going to try to ambush him. Can we go over here and ambush him? Maybe right here. That way you can't just shoot me straight up. 
Ha ha! Sneaky sneak. He's probably just gonna run over and shoot. Oh, what? 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 I'm speechless. He just ran through the... the gate right there. Hello. Oh, jeez. Two-handed hit. Oh, crap. I gotta get up there. All right, Radley. Move up, my man. And do we want to aim? 63%? Why is it so low? Let's get some stats on the on the screen here. Um, engaged. And I'm just really bad at shooting. Really? Well, I want Wordstone first. So we're going to go ahead and... I want to make sure I'm grabbing the right... Yeah, okay. This is the right... These are all the right kind. Uh, confirm gather. Wordstone shard. We just got to stay alive. And we got to keep our... That's really bad. Our leader is engaged, but he's got the best Wordstone. All right. Grab that. Mm, I like that we're all clumped up, but there's too many guys back by their cart. Too many, too many. One, two, three, four by the cart. So there's... We know there's only these two here, so hopefully we'll be able to... Kind of make short work of... Oh, what happened? We lost a red pill. We got Wordstone Curse. That sucks. All right. Switch weapons. I'm trying to remember if I can check. I think I can if I go like this. Sword in his other hand. Um... Radley, Radley. I'm kind of thinking we might want that sword. Well, no, I'm not so sure. Whatever. It's too late now. <laughs> Can't change it. All right, right there. Kanor is going to run forward. I want to get as much of this wordstone as I possibly can. Good, 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 good. This is good. We can reach three of them from right here. Even though two of them are small buggers. And we can uh, get a chance to shoot and reload. And that reminds me, actually, we should shoot before we lose the chance to, like we did with uh, Radley. So it didn't end up mattering. Reload for one. Oh, I forgot it's only for one. And we're going to wiggle over here so we can cheatsy doodle. Get that. Ooh, if we can just stay alive, we're going to get a lot of wordstone this time. Warp effect. Okay, fine. I want to change this. I like to... I personally like to see my debuffs. That is what I like best. So I know what I'm getting into. Warp effect. Inventory is full. Okay, now we've got a... We can do a dodge dance. Um, yeah, let's do that. All right, Uriant. Now, I really do want their stuff at their at their cart, but I think I need to back I need to back up the people that are already here in the field that are already engaged. Namely my leader who has all the best wordstone. There we go. We got a hero and a leader versus a Henchman, so that should be okay. Clinger Sattler. Clinger Sattler. Alright, here's where it might get a little sketchy. Erbhard Waldenstein. What? Where are they going? They're hiding. They're all, like, running... This is weird. The AI seems like they're behaving very strangely. All right, he's ambushed in that building right there. Resk's turn. Can I get... I don't think I can get all the way up to my leader, but I can try. I can get over here and stick him in an ambush. I mean, that's pretty good. I'm abandoning my cart, but I'm assuming... Oh, it's Baldbert. 
Baldbert. I'm uh, abandoning my cart, but I'm assuming that the AI is stupid and not going to cause me a lot of problems on that front. I would love to get a charge, but I can't with just the two red pills I've got. Okay, I'm going to stick them over here into an ambush just in case. Try to protect my archers. A new round has started. Okay, weapons of destruction. Do we want to do that? Um, I think we want to attack. I think that's going to be better for us. Chop. And then this will cost three. Chop. Yeah, if we can get this guy down, that'll be good. It'll free us up a little bit. Um, and take the dodge. You know, I think I'm going to be building my, uh, what do you call them? Not my, uh, my Dark Souls, that's it. My Dark Souls as dodginess, um, because they're going to have two-handed weapons, and they will not be able to, uh, words, come on, words, they will not be able to, uh, parry, very likely, unless I give them halberds. It's, that's the only two-handed weapon that, you can, oh, this dude's full, dang, what am I doing? Bradley's all full, full to go. I feel like their guy's just through that doorway right there. Um, yes, so most two-handed weapons cannot parry, and so what I'm planning to do is build them to be dodgy instead. All alone, success. You're a jerk. Oh, good, he's splitting his attention. That's all right. And a dodge. And we're going to aim. Take him down, please. Yes, good. Good, 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 good. Oh, good, good, good. This dude's inventory is full, so I'm gonna park him, like, right here, and we'll do a free perception. Because I'm not planning on using that blue pill for anything else, so we might as well. And Uriant. Uriant is gonna track down that shooter. Where is he? Where was he last seen? Right here? I don't think he climbed up. Overwatch, where did that come from? Oh, from right over there, okay. All right, um, that is okay because uh, he is, now he is exposed as heck. So we have a one-hander, that means we can charge first, miss, we can charge and miss, and then we get one more attack. Because it only costs... Oh, miss and miss. Come on. And we can bring our Dark Souls through here, hopefully, and shore things up a bit. All right, let me turn. There's a bunch of guys in a row here. Ah, crap. I've got this cut on my thumb, and I keep banging it. I, like, slice it on some sheet metal. It's not too bad. It just, is like, catches on everything. Jeez. And I keep bumping it. But never mind about that. You gonna charge me, bro? Ambush. Interesting. Uh, see, this is where it gets fancy because I want to take this hero down, but I don't want to split my attention too much, and I kind of have to 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 get this done. Yeah, because their hero, their hero, and that henchman are going to be on us next round. All right, Baldbert, Baldbert, Baldbert. What do I want you to do, Baldbert? Ball, Balbert. Can I run through here? No, I cannot. Okay, I'm going to see if I can make it over to that henchman. Or that, that hero. I think that would be the best use of our... Did I miss some? This seems like not enough movement. He just slow as crap. That's what's up. If he can't make it there, I'm going to come back. Uh, yeah, he can't. Dang it. All right, Uriant, please hold that guy down and sock him for me. I'm going to do this right now because we're not going to get another chance. And then I think I'm going to use this fella to pull that henchman, <clears throat> excuse me, pull that henchman forward. That is my plan. Oh, nice, you can carry four. It's going to be some serious debuffs, but that's, I think, okay. 
All right. Maybe not. I mean, it depends. It's luck of the dice. Warp effect damage. What do we got now? Wordstone corruption, block switch weapons. That's not that bad. We're actually, I feel like we're doing reasonably good. Having the wordstone right here is so very good. That was like the best. All right, I'm gonna try. I don't think I can out charge this guy, but I'm gonna try. Did I see someone else? No, I thought I did. Oh, I saw it for just a split moment. 51, God, those halvers hurt. You're a jerk. Get chopped, Rambrandt, Rambrandt Richter. And right here we can do a charge, which is what I want. Obi-Wan that I want. Ah, but the chance is so bad, 70%. We're doing it. All right, Aaron Jesus, I've baked you fresh croissants. Please give me good rolls. Yes, good, 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 good. The croissants work every time, you guys. That's my secret trick. Arn Jesus wants started. baked goods. Okay, Beeblebrox is going to... Weapons of Destruction. On Resk, maybe? Um, let me see... What it does... Spells, weapons of destruction, melee. Uh, so it's armor piercing and damage increased by twenty percent. That is not going to be as good as me turning the corner here and attacking this dude. What is he at now? He's at full health. I'm, that's right. I missed him a bunch of times, but he's coming up next. Mm. Dang, I'm really torn because the more guys we have over there, the more split away from from this whole mess we're gonna be we've got archers coming up before come on let me in come on it's super close just give it to me stop trying to hit me and hit me let me through there we go clown car clown car dang it miss you jerk <laughs> he's so hard to hit there's a hit our first one. Okay, all alone, fail. Get, get, ch oh, he can't, okay. He didn't have space to flee. I was hoping beyond hope that he would, but he did not. So, okay, here's what we're doing. We're gonna attack, I should have charged. 27, crit, stun, thank you. Now Yurient will be able to uh, get him for free. And by get him, I mean attack. Uh, he'll, he'll, he's guaranteed a hit when the bad guy is stunned. That's what I mean to say. Take him down, please. Oh, dang it, he's so close. So close right now. What do you have? You're full up on backpack, so I'm gonna... I don't think I want to back you up too far. I'm just gonna put you in a dodge. I'm hoping that my Dark Souls can hold their own. Free attacks, please. I need my Dark Souls to hold out one more round, and they're going to have a lot of guys coming up. So, uh, we shall see. We'll take the little bit worse chance for the chance at a parry. Oh, God, he's got a halberd, too. Oh, 79 dodge fail. Good, just one attack. Jeez, that hurt really bad. All right, we're at... Rambert and Richter's at 4 life. Baldbert's at 44. Resk is at 27. Crap. No sign of the archers yet. So these guys will be able to take this guy down. Um, attack. Oh, dang it. That's not what I wanted. Okay. Here's what we're doing. Taking down Ram... Ram Bad dice. Crap. All right, this might be kind of bad, you guys. A new round has started. Take him down, please. Thank you. And weapons of destruction only cost one. So we're gonna cast it here. Thank you. 
And weapons of destruction. I'm gonna take the 35% curse chance. Come on, baby. Give it to me. Good dice. Come on. Yeah, yeah. And bring him out uh, this way. Let's see. What do I need to do? I need to bring him up. Right here for a potential all alone check. Oh, he can't do it. Okay, I took too much of a wandering route. Meandering, even. Dang it. I'm pretty sure he can make it. I just need to be smart with my moves. I need to cut it, cut my corners closer and things like that. Can I just go over here? Yeah, that's gonna be better. No damage, please. Thank you. Thank you, thank you very much. And we can't attack, but we can dodge. Because we gotta take that guy down. And Radley has weapons of destruction. He is going to back up our uh, other... Oh, please make it. Please make it. Charge. Get him. Please, come on. Oh, dang it. Such bad dice. We're almost at the end of the episode. This is going to be an unintentional cliffhanger for you fine ladies and gentlemen. Take him down, please. Oh, my gosh. You guys. <laughs> the dice are so bad. The dice are so bad. Okay. Uriant is going to loot this sucker. I don't think we can wield these pistols, but they do sell for something. So that'll, that's, that's something. Wow, he looks like a goon. His eyes are open on the ground. Okay. Going up here. Jumping down. We've only got one set of movement left. Crap. That's awful. I can't even get in there to back up my guys. Oh, jeez. I wish I could take that back and try to get a little extra... I need one more blue pill to get over there to get to his captain. Oh, captain, my captain. Can I ambush from anywhere around... Or can I charge, I mean... Dang it. Um, I don't want to put him in an ambush. And the reason that's the case is I'll be spreading my guys too thin. I don't I don't want Urien to solo someone else. He's got ah, crap. All five of his red pills are going unused. Alright, I'll stick him back here in an ambush. Dang. We're gonna need some good luck to pull this one out. Oh, buddy. Oh, 52, he hits so hard. Dodge fail. Crap. Oh my gosh, we are getting tracked, you guys. Crap in a hat. And our tanks are all down. Basically, it's Uriant is our remaining tank. What do we got here? Uh, Radley's at 28. Beeblebrox is at 2. Uriant is at 77. Kanora's at 106, so Kanora's got to get in there and pull his own dang weight. A new round has started. Uh, what do I want to do? What do I want to do? What does disengage cost? Two red pills? <laughs> Miss, of course. And I think I have to disengage right here. Because Beeblebrox is just hurting too bad. Dang. We're going to need some seriously lucky dice to pull this one out. Alright, take him. Eliminate him, please. Thank you. That took way too long. We're going to go right here. Take that dodge. Alright, what are they at? They're at 16 out of 18. So they actually, uh, when it is their leader's turn, we're going to have a chance at, at forcing them to rout here. Crossbow, halberd. It's not going to be worth as much as our wordstone. The wordstone is going to be better. Please fail your route test. Please fail your route test. All right, you guys, 
I need you to do a, a important, super important route dance right now at your computer. I need your help. Please dance. Please tell me what kind of dance you did. This is it. Right after we attack and then go into and miss and then go into... I think our dodge is going to be better. And I'm going to take the better chance because this guy hits like a truck. Okay, right now. We need... We need a route test right now. Please fail. Route test failure! Yes! Jeez! That was a brutal sneak attack for you. Yikes! All right, we lost two. We took out three. Beeble Brox was MVP this round. Jeez, that was super intense. And perfect timing, too. This is just the right length for this episode. You are progressing nice. Okay. Dang, Remarkable. that was intense. All right, I want to see Chaos what injuries we got. Your ant survived. Oh, he got a mutation. Wonder what it could be. I think I saw his arm turned into an axe. Fantastic. Kenora leveled up. Uh, mysterious ailment. All right. And broken jaw. I really don't care that much. It's going to be a lower leadership. Um... So he's got two leadership, but he doesn't care about fear and all alone and all that. And his spell casting is reduced. whoop de doo Okay. Items acquired. Light armor, gold crowns, longbow, heavy armor, crimson shade, wordstone fragment, wordstone cluster, mace, axe, dueling pistol, and shard. We got a lot of wordstone. We're going from 44 up in the top right up to 107. That was worth it. That was worth it right there. Our shipment is weight 100, so now we have enough to do it when the time is right. Okay, 172. We're becoming poor. Confirm. We're going to pay treatment. Confirm. Pay treatment. Confirm. All right, we got three days to burn because all of our, uh, all of our melee guys are uh, out for the count here. So I like Baldbert's name, so I'm going to swap Resk out for Sharpadin, who is rank one. He's a little bit better. And uh, that's going to make an episode here. I hope you enjoyed this first episode of The Blighted, uh, this possessed campaign. Let's check super quick what mutation he got. Ooh, look at that. So he is now a dual-wielding specialist because uh, Executioner is a pretty good one, actually. That's a, an armor uh, absorption debuff. So that's pretty good. Now the question is, I have five red pills, so I can attack. Yeah, that works out. I can attack a couple of times. And we're going to go with a mace for hit chance. So that's a pretty good mutation overall. And uh, yeah, do, do tune in next time for more. And like I said, we're going to be splitting 50-50 between the Blighted, this Possessed Warband, and the Sons of Mermidia, my existing rank 6 or 7 Warband now. Uh, if you like this episode, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. If you didn't like it for some reason, feel free to leave a thumbs down. We will see you next time for more Mordheim City of the Damned.